read by Lindy Sprong. A sample of 86 stories in The People in the Pearl. Crazy on the Nature Trail by John and Frank O'Reary. For the young family from Montana that began a beautiful filled hike on a well-traveled Canada National Park Trail quickly turned into a morning of terror and never to be forgotten struggled for survival. When the U.S. plane crash landed in flames on a control airstrip, there was no chance at all for rescue. The man inside yet Mr. Fisher decided to defy the odds trying to fly him out. Death and the Friendly River by Scott Seeger. We used to think of it as our river. A member of the family unit once iced water by the day when it reached for our lives. Continue on back flap. Trapped in a sea of flames. The veteran smoke jumper knew he only had one desperate chance to survive as the towering forest fire surrounded him. Carried to sea by a tidal wave. When the third wave crashed ashore, it demolished the house and spun its roof out to sea with two passengers aboard. The courage of Carol Little, the awesome triumphant of an injured young mother determined to protect the life of more precious than her own. That is an airlift basket. These are Navy men. This is a pilot. He has road flares. That's a plat crane. I, I'm going too deep. The Lost Boy on Casper Mountain. For more than a week, thousands of volunteers had searched in vain for Kevin Dye, a nine-year-old boy who had vanished in the winds of Wyoming. Now, timing was running out for the little boy. <laughs> 